Hey everyone, this is the Dr. Chris Radio Horror YouTube channel, and this is the Grim Complete Collection. It looks like the Grim books that you would find in the trailer on the show. And it's even got these little tassels to tie the book up in the front. They're like fake leather made of plastic. The binding says the Grim Collection. And it has the rating here, which is TV 14, because this show is filled with a lot of like partial nudity, sex, and violence. For an NBC show, it was uh, pretty graphic, but I think it was on like 9 o'clock at night. So, open it up right now. And it has the illustrations from the first season. Each season has their own illustrations. Of course, that's Adeline right there. That bug creature. And then they list the episodes per sleeve. And each one of the sleeves has one of these Blu-rays. Um, they come out of the sleeves right here, and they're like very soft plastic on the inside, so that way it's not going to scratch your Blu-ray. But each one of the pages, again there's Adeline, um, has uh, a Blu-ray in it. I don't know if these are also on DVD, but uh, of course there's the Captain. Beautiful illustrations. Unbelievable care went into this box set, which is very rare as, I mean, we're in a market, and this came out at a time, you know, DVDs and Blu-rays were not uh, popular even when this came out, and like in 2018 this came out. Um, I thought a lot of care and time were put into this. Now, the Blu-rays individual sets, and this set also contains the uh, Blu-ray exclusive Grim Guide, which I will show you in a moment, and it has a lot of cool bonus material. But I thought I'd continue flipping through here. And you see a lot of the stuff that you've seen on the show. Little behind the scenes photos, little stills. And then some of the little cards that would pop up uh, at the beginning of every episode. Some of those are in here as well. Incredible attention to detail put into this box set. I, I This is one of the biggest reasons I had to get this as well. There's that alien-like creature, which is very rare of them to be around. There is the uh, the voodoo walking dead, um, you know, the Louisiana pufferfish grim. Russell Hornsby on these uh, bonus material right here said this is his favorite one. Oh yeah, the bad hair web episodes. If you ever wonder how uh, Monroe and Rosalie met Bud, the um, you know the beaver. Uh, Vessen, the uh, the ice beaver, that uh, that explains it. Mermaid Grim, I forgot about that. The Krampus Grim, that is one of my favorite episodes with the Krampus. Oh, that was so cool, and I love how in full color that image of the Krampus is. The retail for this box set can range anywhere from about a hundred to a hundred and fifty dollars. I got it for about, uh, I got it for a deal for eighty bucks. So it does run up there in price. It can, and as the years go by, these will go out of print. And again, they contain a lot of the web episode series, which were only available on the NBC website. They were not broadcast. Um, so maybe sometimes during the broadcast, they would tell you, oh, we're doing a web episode series, go to NBC.com. And there were like little mini episodes they decided to do based on, you know, some of the secondary characters that weren't the Grim himself, Nick or Ross. Um, again, obviously the first web series had to do with Bud and his hair loss, bad hair day. And they even throw in here, like, how to deal with a, uh, a Vessen that you have to vanquish and stuff, which is really cool. And sometimes they're written in Latin. Most of the time this uh, is, like, you know, handwritten in English. More of the bonus material. And the DVDs also change color, too. So each season has their own color. Blue, green, orange now for season five, I believe. Yeah, season five. 
Ah, one of my favorite Grim characters, Trouble. It was a cool creature effect they did. And then the full cast. I love how this cast, I mean, Trouble, not really a main character. I mean, she kind of went in and out of the show. But, I mean, these the all of these characters right here, they were the main uh, cast uh, through the whole show, which is fantastic. Nobody left, which is great. Now, I'm going to show you, real quick, a couple of cool little grim tidbits. So, right there, that is Monroe's mom, played by Dee Wallace. That is a picture signed to me from her. And she's also on my Howling uh, Blu-ray signed to me and my copy of E.T. Because a lot of people don't remember. Yeah, she was the mother from E.T. Okay, now real quick, I'm going to show you the Grim Guide. There's every there's one of these per every single Blu-ray. I know these are only on the Blu-ray box set for the show. So you basically have the list of every single Vessin that appears on the show. You click on their name, and then they bring you to what that Vessin is. And if you can't pronounce their name, you know, I, it's good luck as me. But they also give you the uh, writing from the, the books that... Nick would research, which I think is really, really cool. So if you want to reread up on some of these Vessin, and they even play you little clips from the show of the Vessin voguing out, or maybe doing something really cool. I have the sound off just because it's going to be, this is on YouTube, and you know there might be some music playing and copyright infringement with that sort of stuff, which is not great, so... But um, you don't have to keep going back to the index. You can keep it getting next. And then pick a, you know, a Vessin that you want to watch for. Okay, what's funny is that one reminds me of the Fluke Man from the, um, the X-Files episode. Again, I love the fact that every single new creature that appears on the show gets their own little page on this uh, bonus material for the Blu-ray. Now, if you go back to... Okay, so now, if you go back to the, um, the title screen, it plays just like a lot of Universal television series or movies will play. You have the screen that flips out, uh, the menu screen flips out this way, and then you can highlight what you want. There's no commentary on any of these, but you basically just hit the extra button, and then you get all the extras. The gag reel is real funny. Some of Monroe's best moments are hilarious, and then this is the Bad Hair Day episodes involving Bud uh, trying to cure his uh, you know, hair loss, which is pretty funny. Uh, all, eight, all the four of these episodes is about eight minutes in total, so they're very, very short. Again, if you have a Blu-ray player... Um, I highly recommend checking this, getting this set. Uh, the set also comes with a digital copy of the entire series. I've already, I've already given it away, unfortunately, but uh, you do get two copies of the show. You get a digital copy and you get the physical copy. Check out the rest of the, uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Make out, make sure you check out the rest of the videos here on the Radio Horror YouTube, YouTube channel. Like, subscribe, and comment if you could. And if you're a big Grim fan, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you very much for checking out the uh, my review of the Grim Complete Collection box set.